a good citizen. You know, this year we did something a little bit different. We established a website called um, www.whyistheshowsolong.com. And we received about 35,000 jokes. And these are the best three. <laughs> the first one, th these, are, these are real jokes. These are, these are from fans all across the country. And we got, we got uh, letters from, uh, you know, email from Norway, Finland, China, every place. So this one is from R. Lang, which is, why is the show so long? Because there are just so many little people. It's cute. These are website jokes, folks. <laughs> the next one comes from Jay Phillips, which was, what was Bill Clinton's favorite movie last year? 101 donations. <laughs> it's not bad, Steve, you know? And the last one comes from D. Snow, quote, it comes out of my mouth, you know, I expect to win an Oscar next year. I'm making a movie called Price is Very Sexy and Waterhouse is a Genius. <laughs> not bad. So thank you, America, for sending these in. And speaking of Price Waterhouse, Wow. <laughs> there is a gentleman from the firm who was retiring after 21 years of servicing Oscar. That sounds terrible. He is... <laughs> and I mean that. 21 years, he's being replaced, and let's bring him out right now. Ladies and gentlemen, Frank Johnson. 21 years. 21 years, Frank Johnson. Thank you. Frank, just say best picture and we can eat. <laughs> Frank is being replaced by Jim and Susan McDougall. <laughs> From MTV to their own hit movie, these animated characters are what happens when Sylvester the Cat and Tweety Bird make it with Leopold and Loeb. Here are the bad boys of MTV, Beavis and Butthead. We're movie stars. <laughs> uh, well, uh, good sound effects editing can make the difference between a boring chick movie with some English dude and a really cool movie with lots of explosions and stuff. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like Under Siege 2. Uh, for example, when I smack Beavis, sound effects create the illusion of pain. <laughs> Well, uh, the nominees for best sound effects editing are uh, Richard L. Anderson and David A. Whitaker for Daylight, Alan Robert Murray and Bub Asman for Eraser, Bruce Stambler for The Ghost and the Darkness. <laughs> and, um, and the Oscar goes to... Uh, <laughs> check it out. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Bruce Stambler for the Ghost and the Darkness. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Thank you for the Academy, director Stephen Hopkins, Michael Douglas, Stephen Ruther, uh, the entire sound editing team at Soundstorm. Everyone's great there. I couldn't. I wouldn't be here without them. Uh, Don Mitchell, Frank Montano, Rick Hart, Mike Herbeck, and Peter McGregor, Scott, Dennis Verkler, Joel Schumacher, Carol D'Antuano for their continual support. My family, Nan, Kelly, and Robbie. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>